meantime, San Diegans still trying to recover from flooding could be getting a helping hand from the feds. The Small Business Administration announcing it will be awarding low interest loans for those impacted by flooding. And KUSI's Ripper Weigel is live from the Embarcadero with a breakdown of the process, how it all works, and how much you'll need to pay back if you qualify. Good evening, Rafer. Yeah, good evening, Teresa. Yesterday we talked about FEMA awarding grants. Well, now the U.S. SBA ready to loan out millions of dollars to the thousands of San Diegans affected by flooding. And while some like the idea of a low interest loan, the question is, at what cost? So they've got fans underneath the building as well as blowing underneath the building since the hole underneath of this building was completely full of water up to nine feet. Kristen Dennis is one of many small business and nonprofit owners still clawing her way back after being devastated by flooding. This was all at about four to six inches of water. Her business incubator, San Diego Made Factory, was gutted last month. The total damage? Right now, we're probably somewhere about a $100,000 loss. The factory, the product of blood, sweat, and tears from Kristen and her three co-founders. And now she's also shedding tears for residents who lost everything. I think that, like, you know, we're, just, just to be blatantly honest, we're four women and, you know, we've built this business. We can't sit here and just build this business and do all of this knowing that there's all these people that need so much. Meanwhile, the U.S. SBA wants to help folks like Kristen awarding loans to businesses, nonprofits, homeowners, and even renters in San Diego hurt by flooding. These are low interest loans that are actually directly funded by the U.S. Treasury. So these are our federal taxpayer dollars at work. You can apply for three types of loans, economic injury, business, and home disaster. You'll need to show credit history and ability to repay to qualify. Businesses and nonprofits can get up to $2 million, homeowners up to 500,000 and renters 100,000 with lower than average rates. If you qualify, there's no interest or payments for a year and you can take up to 30 years to repay. Once there's a completed application, we will actually do a loss verification. Now, if you want to make the job easier, we do recommend taking pictures, but that's not required because we actually send someone out to actually look at the damage. But the money isn't free. And for Kristen, she says borrowing is too costly. We've really tried to stay away from loans because we don't want to have that debt because once we have that loan, we're still paying it off every month. And they're still trying to pay off all of the damages in addition to raising money for dozens of families that have been affected. So many stories of people trying to come together and help each other. If you would like to get involved in either one of those causes, you can go to San Diego Live at the Embarcadero, Rafer Weigel, KUSI News. Teresa, back to you in the studio.